Hello for guys, welcome back to my channel. I have Cholora here once again. We're doing a mukbang or butter chicken. Okay, so there's Cholora right there. She wants to say hello. Hi guys. Mm -hmm. So we just get our prayer done and then we'll just get this going, eh? Okay. Dear loving Jehovah, thank you for this food. Okay, we got the prayer done. Oh, it's a bit hot. Should I take my jumper off? What's under here? Oh no, I've got to sing that. <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, guys, we have sugar cane for drinks. Yeah, I got two. She got two. I did have two, but um, one got kidnapped. Mm -hmm. So cheers. I got these from the sugar cane from Madra. Yeah, next door to Coles. The pork roll place. Yeah, the pork roll place. They normally like lift the ice up all the way over here. But today I said, can I have a little bit of ice, please, so I can get more um, sugar cane drink? Because this is a nice sugar cane drink. But anyway, so in front of us is um, I got the vegetable samosas, butter chicken and rice. And then we got the homemade naan made by yours truly. Yeah, because I bought the the butter chicken and samosas and the girl goes, oh, your order's ready. I go, thank you. And I walk to my car. Get home. No samosas. Yeah, babe, you're meant to wait like a few minutes. Yeah, I know. I should have asked. Is everything here? But no, I just grabbed and left. So I quickly made these and I don't know what they taste like, guys. They still look. Can you see the steam? Yeah. I just got home. I got annoyed because I thought, oh, far out. But anyway, we got some samosas, homemade bibelo samosas, okay? Samoa styles. Mm. So we've already did our prayer, so it's time to eat. So, uh, mm -hmm. I already said cheers. Mm -hmm. Ooh. You know some mussels, eh? When I had some in Papa Toy Toy, they were so lovely. Because they have, um, see the inside? Potato, vegetables, a bit of cumin, I guess. I don't know how they make it. I've never made it before. Take a bite, guys. Mm hmm You want to have one? So I wash my hands real good because I was thinking I, I eat, you know, like the Indians do with their hands, even though I probably dropped most of it down here. Mm. Yes, I must have got a kick. The karate kick. <laughs> It's hot. Like spicy or like hot? Spicy hot. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And look at my glasses. See these white things down here? They're steam. <laughs> it's hot. Because I'm, I'm too hot, guys. I'm too hot. Yeah. Those so, are good. Yeah, they're nice. That's why I always buy it. It actually is spicy. Oh, it's not spicy. It's like, oh no, it is spicy. Mmm. But they're not the same. Mm. Even though they're just vegetable. Anyway, let me grab one of these. Smell burnt, guys. <laughs> I look damn even fake like a nun. Professional. <laughs> Let's have a look first. Let's taste it. Here, guys, excuse the hands. Yep, Jerry is carrying. Okay. Well, thanks a lot. Just wait if you have to ring the ambulance. <laughs> Why? I don't know, too bad. Mmm. You know how I make these guys? Bye. 
I um got plain um plain flour and I put hot water in it <laughs> and just stirred it. And then it forms into a dough. Mm -hmm. And then you break it up to the amount of uh, nans that you want, like make it into a ball, put it down on the ground, <laughs> not around the bench. Don't put it on the ground. And then come and come and fade. My nan got all dirt on it. <laughs> Your house too. Oh yeah, guys. That's why I went to Mount Druid today. Mm -hmm. I went and got my haircut. My haircut and all the grades had them. Had them real good for two and a half weeks. You know, I come from a family of graves. So it don't take long for the graves to shine back out. You know. Mm. I have more graves than my husband. He's older. Mm -hmm. And you know, his parents, they're super grey. His dad was a, a grey man. You know, like, he was, he had beautiful white hair. You know, silver hair. Well, he had really nice hair. What? Yeah, and our family's like that too. And I think if I wasn't dying, guys, I'm in the grey club. Oh yeah, mm-hmm. But, I'm on my way to a car. You see guys, I gotta tell you something. I've always had this, um, I don't know what it's called. Um, you go to the car, my kids know this, every time we go to my car, there's always a car. <laughs> hey, my dog. <laughs> you find my video. Why am I here? Okay, <laughs> This is thing that always happens with me. When I go to my car, there's always gonna be a car next door. Oh, it's okay. Um, oh yeah. Here's the thing, right? Every time I, I tell my kids this all the time. Every time we go to the car, right? There's always gonna be someone in their car. The car right next next to me. The car right next to my car. So I went to my drive today. And I parked, and there was hardly any cars because my appointment for my hair was early. And then um, I come back out, and I see a group of people next to my car, and I thought, yeah, of course it's going to happen to me. It always does, you know? So I got closer to my car, and I was saying, oh, I overparked to the left. Ooh, and they were on my left. I thought, tracks. Did they have to be there when I get there? Anyway. About three cars before I got to my car, I hear, Favors! <laughs> I thought, oh my gosh! Like yeah. the people that were standing up near your car? Yeah, the people that were standing near my car. Oh, this keeps coming up. Mm. I hear, Favors! And then the girl, she runs over. And she goes, pretty girl too. And she goes, Ah, oh, I'm your biggest fan. Can I take a pup, you know, a picture with you? No for Oh, okay. I'm on I'm on my way. I just got my hair done. Mm -hmm. The lady done my hair the way she wanted. Because she asked me, How would you like it done? And I said, Can you just do it? You know, do it whatever way you want. I don't mind. Right. This is how she did it. That's how You like it? Yeah, I like it. But once I wash it, it won't look like this anymore. <laughs> oh, like, do you mean you like the way she styled it? Yeah, she styled it like this. I've never had it like this before. Yeah. Anyway, getting back to my story. So I took a picture with that girl. 
No, that was funny. I told him that I parked too close on the left to them. You know. I said, yeah, I'm the car there park, parking too close to you guys. <laughs> it always happens, guys. Whenever I go to my car, there's either someone in the car, sleeping, just about to reverse, or they're sitting there all the time. You see that, eh? Yeah. Wait, mm. what? When I'm telling the people. Yeah. Every time we're like, like either parking or like we're coming back to the car, she's like, see guys, see, it's always a car next to me. <laughs> but they're either leaving or they're going in. Or they're just sitting in their car. Okay. Now about this one. Once my brother and I, and our sons, because our sons are very close, okay? So we headed off to Mount Dewey this other time. And if you know Mount Dewey at all, you go to the, um, you go past Mount Dewey at um, KFC, and then there's a ramp to go upstairs. So, <laughs> bring the plate near your face. <laughs> Don't worry, you can rinse it out later. Yeah, but that was gonna be for us. Oh wait, you can't even see it. Okay. Mm. Mm. Anyway, so what was I saying? I was really interrupted. Yeah, by the butter chicken. Oh yeah. So my brother, he goes up to the ramp, and the first car park, he parks on the right. He parks here, and I was thinking. All the way over here. Do you know how long we have to walk down to the to the entrance of Madra? Five million years. Anyway, probably five minutes, but you know, drama queen here. Mm. So we went. So we walked all the way, huffing and puffing, because we all huffed and puffed, you know. And then, um, so we, we were there for about nearly two hours, you know. So... On our way back, we had to walk all the way, all the way to where we parked. My brother, oh, no, no, I would never park that far. Hmm. And you know why he said he parked there? Because he doesn't like it where um, he parks and then people will come and scratch his car. My brother, he's like my dad, very fussy. Anyway, and um, hey. oh, this is some muscles, beautiful. Anyway, so we were going to to the car, we're putting away our shopping. There's about two other cars that had the, you know, they had the same thing, you know, my brother parked all the way, nearly parked at home. Anyway, so there's two other cars. So as we were packing away our shopping, I looked down at the far distance, I see this couple pushing a trolley. They're, 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 they're about this much, really small, they're far away. Anyway, we're yapping away, putting away our shopping, turned around. Now it's not like this anymore. It's like this. The body's like this. And then we're walking this way. I said to my brother, Hey, do you know I have this thing that people always come to the car next door? And my brother goes, Yeah, that always happens to me too. And I thought, Oh, 20s! 20s! Anyway, guys, did they come to the car next door to us? Yes, they did. They sure did. Now, that's why I know this always works. This always does it for me. Why can't it be I always get the the closest to the winning lotto or I always get the winning lotto? Why can't it happen like that? No. It has to happen to car parks. <laughs> I win at car parks. <laughs> anyway. So... A lot of good things happened today, I reckon. Mm -hmm. One, I got my hair cut. Two, my mum made it to the bus this morning. <laughs> That's what happens when she gets ready and then she sits around and then the bus, beep, beep. But lucky, I had time to comb her hair and then take it to the bus. 
because when they ring up to they always they always ring up to make sure that the elderly elderlies are not sick or anything. So when they fear that they're well, they'll come pick them up. So you know, sometimes they ring and I'm in the middle of I'm wrestling my my mum in the shower because she's not listening. <laughs> anyway, so it's good that they ring. You know, I don't know. Maybe there's times that they've turned up at my door and um. Excuse me, I forgot all about it. <laughs> mm. Mm, no. Oh, baby. Anyway, I wanted to try this thing, guys. There's a channel that I love watching. It's called Ape Eats. It's about this lady and her husband and her little dog, Bella. <laughs> well, I watched this lady eat, right? And the way she eats, I see nothing fall down. I see some food fall down when her husband does it, but not when she eats. So I noticed how I watched it carefully. So what she does, she gathers food together, and then she puts it like this, and I see her strike her, push her thumb forward to push the food in the mouth. Wait. Mm. I think more practice will do. And then I watch her husband, he like this. Mm. Yeah, but that was cleaner than the first one. Oh, well, that's because I didn't draw properly. So I pay if you come in here. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> i got to say them properly. Anyway, I pay each, I've been watching her now since near the beginning of uh, my channel, you know. Yeah, she's a really nice lady, you can tell. And her husband, he's a joker. He, he takes around. Anyway, here we go. Mmm. -hmm. Mmm. -hmm. That was nice. <laughs> that was actually nice. Sorry, guys. I'm not talking. I'm kind of like tired. And I don't really know what to talk about. So that's why I'm not talking about that. Mm. I don't know why my mom asks me to be in videos because... I like eat for the first 15 minutes of the video and then after that I'm full so then I like I like start slowing down. Yeah. But she like loves me in her videos. I don't know why. I think I just uh, um, eat up the space. <laughs> no. I was thinking that on the way home. I was thinking, okay, I'm buying these food, then I have to pay the, the little brat. <laughs> And you would think that she'll give me a family discount? No. Mom, save my money. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I got things to pay off. Yeah, and, and I this don't. is how I do it. I sit here for 15 minutes, eat my food, and then look pretty. Psh, psh, psh. I like your hair. Mm -hmm. Thank you. No worries, babe. Same time. I love that. That's a thing, eh? Like, that looks really messy. Ah. Yeah, but it's nice. You know, I've got a best friend named Teddy. Teddy Elia. Yeah, well, she mainly uses her hand for food. Usually, use, I'll be eating with knife and fork, spoons, and it's her. She's just hand, hand, hand. Mm -hmm. The other day, I like let my friend try mine, and she didn't like it. I was Ooh. offended. Ooh. Janie, shout out to you, Janie. Janie watches your videos. So, Janie, if you did stay mm. this far into the video, shout out. Love you. Oh, yeah. That was so nice of that girl to walk up. I think that was her partner. They took the picture. So, hello to you. I, I was driving away. I, was like, oh, I didn't even ask her name. So, sorry. Man, this food's nice. <laughs> Even my teeth look orange. I don't know how to do it. Yeah. What a messy hand. Look at that. Yeah, can you like lick it? It looks really messy. Yuck. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> oh, sorry, I'm running off of like an hour sleep. So nah, I just, I just like watching them. I love watching, you know, people eat with their hands. So cute. No, 
If you don't know what you're doing, yeah, this is what you happen. This is what happens. You know this man. Mm -hmm. But I just wanna have the feeling, man. If the people that eat with their hands, if they're watching me, they're going, "What is that old lady doing?" I'm making sandcastle guys. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Ah, uh, stop it! I just want to be like you guys, dog. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And the really nice too. No, unless it's like a burger, chips, nuggets, things like that. I won't eat with my hands. <laughs> yeah. I know. <laughs> they probably don't do it. And I'm going, la, la 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 la. Hey, it's my food, so stop it. I'm trying to squeeze it together. Mm. Yeah, that lady I'm out there didn't put my nun in the packet. Did you pay for it? No, yeah, I don't steal it. No, she probably walked out there like, do you know nun? So you know what? Oh, okay. Man, because you guys use your order. I don't Yeah, but then you wait for your. You obviously don't order it. No, I wasn't know. looking because I was busy talking to you on the phone. So you're the distraction. You're the distraction. What are you leaving that bit? A full face. For decoration? Look at this. Hang on, mate. <laughs> no, no. I know, you guys probably go, man, she shouldn't have started eating with her hands. <laughs> I just wanted to practice. Yeah. See, I stop it. Going to get my hair done on Thursday by my sister, Hope. Oh, yeah. I'm going to make a vlog out of it too. It's mom channel. It's Chilara. So in a few days, you should get a vlog from me. I'm gonna go to my sister's salon. Are you? Get my head on. Mm -hmm. Guess he's gonna pay for it. No, I'm not. Guess he's gonna pay for it. Don't even point my way. It's not that expensive. Put it this way. I didn't tell you to get your head done. You want to do it yourself? No, she came to me. She was like, oh, I need a client. And I was like, okay. You got one. Why didn't matter go? Oh. Yeah, matter go. Yeah. Guys, um, for those who do know about my channel, I recently, like yesterday, I reached a thousand subscribers. I know. It's so proud of my baby. <laughs> Even though I never... Um, share her, her video. Yeah, all. my mom doesn't watch my videos, but it's alright because if she watched it, I would get a hearty. Mm. <laughs> I better not find anything in there. I only watched the um, the chili one, and it got dead rays in it. You <laughs> watched all of it? Mmm. Oh, what? What? Did you really clean up the egg on the yes. house? Yeah. Yes, Sharon made me. Yeah, so she should. No, I actually did. Sharon made me. I enjoyed the video all the way to the end, laughing and everything. Yeah, a lot of kids enjoyed it. And then I see the egg cracking, and I, and I saw this yellow yolk go. You know what? I didn't. I stopped watching any further. I was screaming. Fuck, God, you laid me all that. People in my comments are like, when your mum sees that, you gotta run because she's gonna give you a hiding. I'm like, oh, wow. I'm definitely not painting your hair now. Just remember. But I cleaned the mess. I have a mess today. Okay, mm -hmm. go. Bro, try and listen. Want me to ring her? No, actually, 
I turned off a, her video and, and I came around here. Looked and looked and looked and saw nothing. Uh, but still, I've even got a big canvas over there. It's probably mudged in with that yellow canvas, oh yellow part of the canvas. Guys. And caked on. Mm. No. Ah, I bit my thumb. <laughs> Funny. It's funny. Everyone laughed in the comments. <laughs> I was shaking down like I'm a mom. Mm, baby. You know what? I went to look at my hair and then I went, huh? Mm. Yeah, it looks nice. I like the way that the girl done it. Yeah. Yeah, well, I just left it to her to do. The owner did it. I'm, I'm actually running up for one hour of sleep. Oh my god. I stay up and I talk to my friends and then next thing you know, I look outside, I can hear birds chirping. What? Okay, what rubbish do you talk about? Bro, we talk for hours. Hours. Don't worry, that's not me. <laughs> I remember when I was about 14, 15, 14 I think. There's this guy that always wanted to talk. Talk, oh, talk, no. talk, 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 talk. We we'll start talking about seven o'clock. Wait, did you say fourteen? Fifteen. He was fourteen talking to boys. Anyway, no. He was from D La Salle, and I was from Tangaroa College. Tangaroa College. Okay. No, yeah. I've never met the guy. He just wanted to talk. Yeah. So there was this guy. I won't mention his name. He has his marriage with kids. He used to go to D La Salle. And my cousins know him, so he asked my cousins to get my number. Do you have a phone like that? Yeah, one of those ones you pick up and then you, you, you go. Oh, I like that. So he stayed in Mangare and I stayed in Utara. Mm -hmm. We will talk after, no, after our dinner. And my dad, my poor dad will wake up about six o'clock to go go to work. My dad, I hear his door open. And then um uh, I whisper, my dad's waking up. <laughs> okay? And then after the whisper, it's like, my dad's waking up. And then when he, my dad opens the door and I'm going, you know, I freeze and I pretend I'm a part of the furniture. Mm? And he goes, what are you doing up? And I go, oh, I just, I, I just answered this call. But really, <clears throat> being on all night. Oh, my God, it's talking rubbish. <laughs> you would stand there and talk? No, I get a chair. Oh. And I take it over to where my, our phone is. And we will talk. And we both got school. And we will talk, 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 <laughs> talk, 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 talk. Anyway, I eventually got to meet this guy. But we were in little with bees. <clears throat> mm. Got to meet him. And I thought, what a good looking guy. I've never seen him in my life. But, what was know. his background, Modi? Chamon. <laughs> He's from Mangare. Probably not living there anymore. But anyway, it was, it was nice knowing that person anyway. But with just little kids, you know, hanging out. <clears throat> Yeah. Yeah. So what happened is the moral of the story, um, make it short. Um you know how that thing is, you know, when someone's more into you than you are and more into them? Yeah, it was like that with me. So you were into them more than he was into you or No. I, I wasn't I wasn't <laughs> oh, he was really good looking. He was really good looking, tall in height, which I like. But it, it, to me, it's like I don't know. Maybe I I underestimated my own self worth. But to me, I thought he was out of my league. I thought he was too, cause he hung around with the cool people. He knew the cool people. Me, I knew nobody. I just go to school, come back home. But yeah, and uh, knowing his family as well, I thought I'm out of his league. 
So it made me uncomfortable. So I had to call oh, it off. Oh, like you were too good for him. Is that what you're saying? No. He was too good for you. Like he come, he was like a, at another level of, you know, you know yeah. To me, I, I just thought I wasn't worth that, wasn't that high in that. And the, all the people that he knew, like even my cousins and that, my cousins are cool too. But anyway, so I had to call it off. I had to call our boyfriend and girlfriend relationship off. He was heartbroken, wrote me a letter and everything. Oh, wow! I know. Okay. <laughs> but if it's not there, it's not there. You know. So if you're out there and you know it's me, that's it. Because <laughs> I'm no lady now, so he's probably going, man, she aged good. Nah. And jokes, jokes. But anyway, he knows my name, I know his. So he probably looks at it. Comment down below, nothing. No, don't even comment down below, please. I'll tell your wife. Tell your wife if you've got one. Or your husband. <laughs> no, yeah, he's, no, he's not even like that. Because he was more, he was, I, I, I used to hear stories like a lot of girls like him and he wants this blackie. But anyway. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah, so that's how it went. A little more be, put it that way. I knew I was a little more be, I shouldn't have even been. But nearly all the time, nearly every night we would talk from dinner time till six in the morning. Far oh, out. Sometimes I go, can you let me sleep, man? <laughs> no. You know. <laughs> anyway, subject to talk about in front of your daughter. So what you're saying is you had a boyfriend at 14? 15. You are 14? Listen, staying up I was just all talking. Night, staying up all night, talking to boys. No. That's what you're saying. No. And phone bill to the cost that much back in those days. So what you're no. saying is you stayed up, so I'm gonna stay up with boys. Okay, guys. You know what? <laughs> Better watch it. Five is just allowing me to have a boyfriend. No mm. way. Anyway, guys, my what my parents didn't know, my parents up? didn't know. Yeah, I I gotta go. Cause my mom is back, and I gotta go feed her. My glass is still fogging. <laughs> We both got a mirror now, so guys, so you guys are going to be oh, seeing yeah. us always looking on it. you guys know that? I was just looking at my nice hair that the lady done. So, so a lot of good things happened today. We wake up, praise God. He's the one that always looks after us to feed us and everything. So he blesses us all the time. That's why we always got to, you know, say a prayer and thank him daily. Thank him all the time because far out, we're so blessed. Unlike the wars that's happening right now, oh, it's so hurtful. And the Indians, all the people that's, um, you know, passing away for the COVID, that's hurtful. Far out. It's so, um, so sad, eh? Because we're living a good life and here they are, you know, waiting for a bomb to come their way or whatever. That's sad. Man, it's a sign of what was in the Bible, what my mom used to teach us when we were younger. That all these things will happen when near the ending. You know, I know some of you guys go, oh my gosh, why ending? Stop it. You know, <laughs> now I'm just pretending someone's throwing something at the TV or the phone. Sorry, I didn't mean to throw that at ease. Yes, you did. I was showing that someone, you know, because some people when they hear about God, they don't really want to hear about God. But, you know, when you appreciate God, you love to hear about him or you love to talk about him. I love to talk about God. That's why, sorry. I try and cut it out as much as I can because I don't want anyone to think, is this a church or is this a service or... Hey, who said that? <laughs> Comment down below if it's you. Okay, anyway, Let's guys. <laughs> I'll wrap you up in a minute. <laughs> okay, guys. Always lovely. Can I do outro? Always lovely having you guys join us. And thank you to the girl and her partner, if that's her partner. Hopefully, hopefully yeah, comment down partner. below. Yeah, that was so good to meet you. And plus, you're a pretty girl. Up close, I thought, oh, she's got a pretty face. And naturally pretty. You know those kind of girls you don't need makeup? Like me, I need makeup. <laughs> and like her, that is eyelashes. Yeah. 
We need those things to help us. I was getting us. ready. I was getting ready, and my mum walked in the door, and I was like, "Mum, my eyelashes aren't on." And she's like, "Who cares?" And I was like, no. "Yeah, who cares?" I said, "Who cares? People know what you look like now without your eyelashes." I don't care. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> don't do that again. Mine was just a, an a, an example. Sorry, sorry about that, guys. Talk about bad influence. See? Don't go into tissue paper. So, so, sorry, guys. Now people are un unsubscribing because of you. <laughs> yeah, go to my channel. Oh, sorry about that, guys. Chalora, you want me to put you on a headlock in front of everyone so I can get more views? No, oh, right. you stop my joke. Apologize right now. <laughs> sorry, guys, for throwing. It didn't even go there. It went over there. But, you know, someone might have blinked and went, oh my gosh, Chalora. Yeah. Okay, I'll chop it up. Can I do the outro? No, anyway, guys. No, I want to <laughs> say goodbye. I do. Okay, guys. I've I got to go because um, my mum is here now and I've got to go and make her food. Wait, Laura. But you guys all take care of each other. Wait, Laura. Mm -hmm. Don't forget. Thank God every day. Wait, Laura. You know what's funny? She got a colouring book in her hand and... I can hear her, like, see me snoring. So I better go and look after it. Mm? But for now, it's time for me to go and say goodbye to Chilora. Bye, guys. And go subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's short right there. Mom, you're going to put it somewhere. It's no. Oh, yeah. And my husband's going to cook. Another food. Oh, I thought you he, were going to be like, he's going to make a channel. I was going to be like, oh. No, he's got... <laughs> <laughs> Don't make fun of my dad. Can you imagine if my husband had a channel? The drama he'll bring to my life. No way. <laughs> he's dramatic now even to ask me for a cup of coffee. <laughs> yeah, okay. Let's go. Guys, sorry. This one here. Crazy lady. Anyway, we're off now. Fasoi fua kia manuia manuia ko wasu. Fasoi fua. Bye.